about that time. Let's do another lot walk. Let's get it. Welcome back guys, Nick up here at Maple Motors in Hendersonville, Tennessee. And today we're gonna to be walking around this car a lot, pointing out all the new rides that just came in. If you're new to the channel, hit subscribe, share, hit like. I try to do these videos every Monday. Also doing the test drives throughout the week, showing you all the flaws on any car that we have. You can go to maplemotors.com for financing and shipping options. Also have 100 detailed pictures. And of course there's about us section telling you about the last 40 years of maple motors of course we specialize in classic american muscle cars and what we're going to do in this video is walk around i'll tell you the year i'll tell you the price and sorry these cars get so dusty in the springtime there's the pollen coming off of this hill so about if i wash them right now at the end of the day they'd be this dirty again so let's go ahead and get started here this is a 1968 cutlass this one is 24 9. And of course there's a test drive video out showing you anything that's wrong with it coming up right next to it we got a 1972 chevelle this one does have the full roll cage they took out the back seat and it is 25 9. Got the kill switch in the back here. Of course, the old 1976 Cutlass sitting here. This one's 11.9. It's getting back down to that price range that y'all like. And the video will be made right after this one. I haven't actually had a chance to make this video yet. Of course the old 68 camaro sitting here with 67 doors it's actually on hold right now first thing this morning it already went on a guy's trying to pick it up from us it's 29.9 but yeah it is a 68 model with 67 doors i know it's kind of confusing then right next to that 73 model camaro with a pearl red paint job at 27.9. And with that being said, a car is on hold, doesn't mean sold. I haven't got any cash on this one yet, so um, I just give somebody a little bit of time to try to come up, send us some money today. But I do know as I walked outside, that one was on hold already. This one right here, 1970 Nova. This thing's fast. Tub rear end, 350 aluminum heads, 29.9. I enjoyed that test drive quite a bit too. head on over to the side row here where we got some core vets one of the vets not up here in the front yet i need to go get it it's a blue one you'll probably see it on the website the old 79 corvette is on hold at the moment it is Chrome bumper convertible sitting here. This is 71, 
What about the 1977 Corvette? This one's 13.9. And that is new inventory as well. I think we put about seven cars on today. We've been going to uh, some big car shows down in Florida this last weekend. This one right here, 1980 Camaro, it is 16.9. Okay, right next to that is a 1974 Firebird. This one is 19.9. Of course, right beside the Firebird, you got another Trans Am. I do believe this one is on hold at the moment. It's a 79 model Trans Am, 15.9. And it may already be sold, but you can check maplemotors.com, see what's currently available day by day. And I've got some more cars I want to show you out here on the lot. But for now, I'll be right back. So what's cool about Maple Motors is we got a toy store right next door on premises. You can ask Pop, say, bring me next door, show me the Hot Wheels. He updates this every week. He's always in here adding new stuff. And what's cool is if you go to Jim Fight's Hot Wheels channel here on YouTube, you can subscribe and see the kind of stuff that he's been getting in. Actually, last week it rained a lot. And what we did is we came in here and we made a video walking around this whole room. It's like a 30 minute video. Go check it out. You can see what he's got. And uh, again, don't forget to hit subscribe to Jim Fight's Hot Wheels channel. For now, let's head on out to the other side of the car lot and show you what else we got in this week. And then we've got a 1979 Pontiac Trans Am sitting here. This one's 15.9. And then we're coming up on the side of the lot here. And right here we have a 1995 Camaro. This one's 9950 with a built motor. The car's actually pretty peppy. Ended up being a really good test drive as well. I do suggest going over and checking that out. We got this side of the lot here. Just picked up this old Ford. I think it was an F100 video is going to be done today hopefully i'm going to go ahead and try to get that test drive knocked out this one's 15.9 and it's a 1966 model and this old truck just went on today it's 21.9 got a fuel injected Vortec motor LS setup this is a 1966 model right next to that I do believe this is still available with the big block sitting in it for 12 9 it's a 1967 Biscayne Now what about the four-door 60 Cadillac? This one's 14.9. Test drive video is out, so you can check it out.
and then this just came in last week it's fairly new inventory too at 16.9 got the old 83 monte carlo okay guys so i'll tell you what we're going to do we're going to glance by all the cars one more time and then i'm going to run through over here i've got a big sold section show you i have a lot of the cars that went out this week that way you know exactly what we had what we got in now and i put it at the end of the video i know some people are like i don't want to see this old cars well you're not the only one on this channel so there's a lot of people that want to see everything that's sold and see all the new at the same time so we're going to do it just like that and again go to maplemotors.com you can see an about us section you can see the uh, detailed pictures the financing and the shipping that we have available every week we get about 10 cars this week we kind of we didn't slack but we sold a lot of them before we got listed and we had 10 we listed seven today so that just gives you an idea 20 percent of our inventory does sell before we can list them we had a really nice 69 firebird that i wanted to list and i never got to it um it actually sold friday before we closed i was a little bit upset about it because i was excited to show you that car a lot of our high-end stuff does sell really fast uh, and then we get you know a lot of different things we get project cars we get mid-range stuff it's just driver ready to go but i'll end up telling you that pretty much as soon as these videos start these test drives that we do we try not to miss anything we want you to know everything about these rides I can't decide what my favorite one we uploaded this week was, but it's gotta be either the Nova or the Camaro. I'm a very big Camaro guy, but after driving that Nova, God, man, it's just got the looks, the power. It was a sweet car. I, I haven't finished driving all of them either. I still gotta do the Ford truck, the old Cutlass over there. There was one more. Oh, it's the Blue Vet. The Blue Vet is not here at the moment try to figure out where it went it may have went on a test drive and if you did see some stuff in the background majority of the time it's either sold a personal ride or just outright not available some of these cars in the background are not even ours that's a parking lot next door where customers park um got a few personal rides that we brought in over here So only call about the stuff that I told you about in the video or that's on maplemotors.com. That'll make things a lot easier and go fluently. Because if you call about something that's not available, I mean, it's all you're gonna get. You got the 79 Trans Am in the back, the yellow one. Don't forget about it. I didn't I noticed a lot of people saying oh your prices have gone up well the whole nation has I don't know if y'all noticed we're having to pay more for all these rides we don't get no special treatment we go out go to the car shows find the cars and I mean we've noticed everything's up and one thing that I have noticed when has muscle cars went down in value if anybody could tell me that it's been a long 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 time ago that doesn't happen so when they go up they usually stay there for a while sometimes go up more every couple years you wait they keep getting higher i remember 69 camaros i could find for 20 grand that was back when i was in high school in 2009 <laughs> so yeah i'm chasing them right now with 35 cash and you can't find them. you can't find a nice 35 they're up and they usually stay there with that being said, let's walk back here to the sold section. Golly. He took his exhaust completely off, didn't he? <laughs> we'll go back here to the big sold section, show you some of the stuff that we got rid of last week. And we'll do that every week at the end of the walk around video. Again, go to maplemotors.com. 
check out our financing, our shipping, and all of our inventory. Okay, so here we go. That's a big section of all the cars that are already sold. We sold the 55 210. Nova still hasn't went out, waiting on a shipping truck on it. You got the old 66 GTO. An old Corvette sitting there. It already rolled out. I personally love that Camaro. Again, you know I'm a Camaro guy, so. Something about them. I also really like that truck. The 71 Duster. 65C10. Got the Holly fuel injection set up. That truck didn't last very long. The old Black Nova sitting over here. Yeah, we built these two awnings just to store soul cars. And it started exploding out of them again. I was like, man, we're going to have to figure out how to ship them out faster. 71 Monte Carlo sitting here. Y'all remember that from last week. Y'all also remember the cop car. It didn't last but a day. It's because it was in that good price range. It's hard to find anything under five grand these days. It's in a decent shape. Uh, 69 Cutlass convertible. Boom. I think that's pretty much it other than the blue Corvette, which is not here at the moment. And you'll be able to see it pop up this week on the channel, hopefully tomorrow. I do appreciate you watching, guys. If you don't mind, hit subscribe, share, hit like. That does keep me making these videos, and I have to have you do that. That way I can actually uh, keep doing this myself. I do appreciate you watching. Thanks, guys.